heavy and heating hosts and sexy new photographs from their romantic holiday to Miami, GMA co-stars Amy Robach and TJ Holmes kiss and engage in close physical contact, the co-hosts of Good Morning America, who were removed from the show when their affair was made public last month, had a passionate date on the pier on Wednesday. TJ, 45, and Amy, 49, paused to talk, laugh, and kiss each other as they strolled around the pier. Amy dressed for the sunny outing in a black top and a leopard print skirt. TJ, who had divorced his wife Marilee earlier that day, wore a white t-shirt and khaki jeans to the event. After that, the couple went to a nearby beach eatery for lunch and drinks. Although Amy didn't miss the chance to wrap her arm around TJ and rest her head on his shoulder, they seemed to lessen their PDA. She gave him a kiss on the cheek as well and he reciprocated by kissing her shoulder. To enjoy some time in the sun before New Year's Eve, TJ and Amy traveled to Miami earlier this week. They were seen Monday loading up on alcohol while making a supermarket run. On Thursday, in advance of New Year's Eve, TJ and Amy returned to New York. The couple's PDA-filled date comes hours after it was reported that TJ, who had been married to Marilee for 12 years, had filed for divorce from her in New York on Wednesday. Exclusive information about TJ's hiring of Robert H. Moses of Moses Zijaman Richards and Notaro, LLP was provided by the U.S. Son, Marilee, TJ's ex-girlfriend, is not currently represented by an attorney. She has just posted on social media and has not yet spoken out about the alleged affair. The ex-couple has a daughter named Sabine, who is nine years old, as their only child. TJ also has two kids from a previous marriage, Brianna and Jaden. After Amy left the $5.2 million marital house she once lived with her ex-husband Andrew Shu, TJ and his wife officially separated, Amy and Andrew have not yet started a divorce process. After word of their affair spread to the public, TJ and Amy were removed off GMA3. According to reports, Amy and TJ's connection will be examined internally before being lifted. A number of different hosts have taken the place of the duo on the program, including Gio Benitez and Jani Norman this week. When Amy and TJ were observed having what appeared to be several PDA-heavy dates and even a weekend getaway together in November, their affair became public knowledge last month. The TV actors appeared close in photos obtained by Daily Mail of them on November 10 enjoying a drink at a bar in New York City. Additionally, they were discovered presumably hanging together at each other's Manhattan apartments. The two, who started hosting GMA3 in 2020, reportedly left for an overnight break at a cottage in upstate New York on November 11 just two weeks before Thanksgiving. Viewers saw an obvious shift to that week's Wednesday program just hours after the site first revealed that the hosts were having an apparent affair. Without Amy or their other co-host, TJ nervously hosted the 60-minute GMA3 show alone. The U.S. Sun exclusively disclosed earlier this month that it appeared as though TJ and Amy might be pushed out of the stuffy morning program. According to a source close to the ABC News program's production, executives and top talent were upset about co-stars Amy and TJ's apparent romance, which had shaken the GMA staff and completely disrupted production. There is no way they can continue working at GMA, according to The Insider.